Hi, I'm July. I'm La Guitar's endorsing artist. Today I will demo another Arcane series guitar, Arcane 200 Black. It has a mahogany body, maple neck with rosewood fingerboard. This is a bolt-on net. It has 24 frets and it's very slim and fast playing and uh, it's very comfortable even at the 20 24th frets you can you can play everywhere the pickups are passive it is equipped with mgh set two humbuckers and one single in the middle five position pickup switch a tone knob and volume knob this guitar also has a push pull switch that splits the calls of the humbuckers it's great for clean sound play draws tremolo and locking nut so let's listen a few riffs and clean sound intro Also show some of the exercises that will help you feel more fluent when improvising and visualizing the neck and they're also good as uh, warm-up exercises. So you can do minor arpeggio like this. This is B minor, right? You can also do it like this. This is D major. All you do is add low B. This is it. For example, if you want to use it as a warm-up exercise or just work on the fluency, you work it up and down the neck. For example, here's a colleague with uh, this arpeggio from Tony McAlbine's solo. Another one I use uh, in one of my songs from the Springs of Time CD that's called Wave of Love. Technically it's minor arpeggio like this. But you change just one note and you get a major 7th arpeggio. And in the Wave of Luck it's uh, a sequence of three of them. Slow one. And for warming up you can use it as an exercise up and down the neck. Like this and I keep it under control and with metronome. And one more arpeggio sounds keyboard like. Uh, you can actually play it uh, in three octaves slowly. <laughs> Another exercise, a minor or a minor Dorian, are probably the first scales that every guitarist learns. But what happens at the beginning stage, many get stuck in the boxes. There's a good one that will help you connect the boxes and see the neck as a whole instead of like fragmented boxed version. So basically you start playing the sequence in uh, all the positions on two strings, like sixth and fifth. as many variations of this one as you can. Start slowly and build it up to speed and please practice with metronome. Rock on!